Greetings, 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 my V family all over the world. This is your gorgeous chief. Finally got a haircut. I know it looks very short, but trust me, it will grow to perfection by the 9th of October when we have VCC the biggest, most unbelievable network marketing event in the world, 2021. All right? And wherever you are, if you have not heard the buzz, felt the energy of this VCC, all right? Something is seriously wrong with you. You don't have Wi-Fi, you don't have data, and you're living alone in a cave. Because if you are connected with the rest of the world, it's buzzing right now. VCC. Everyone is talking about it. People in QNET, the V, outside, everywhere. All right, this is going to be the greatest event ever. So if you are still doubtful whether, or oh, should I attend VCC or not, wake up. The answer is yes, you don't have a choice. You have to attend VCC. It's no longer a choice, it's a necessity, guys. So I want to see you at VCC. I've been spending hours every day with the coin service, Alliance, V Partners, Dato Sri Vijay, Japa, talking about the details and how we're going to make sure the click happens to thousands of people around the world. All right, I can't tell you the number, but we are targeting the largest ever live broadcast number of participants in network marketing. You'll hear it on the 9th of October. All right, guys, welcome to week 39. Super excited. Rank Advancement Week. I gave you a small, you know, wake up call on Friday and told you it was rank advancement week last week simply to create a sense of urgency. As Dato Sri Vijay said, don't procrastinate. Do it now. Do it now. Do it now. All right. Wherever you are, do it now. Okay. Wednesday, qualify for all your rank requirements. So Thursday and Friday, you can focus on raising others from gold to sapphire to platinum to diamond to blue diamond. All right. So if you can meet your criteria by Wednesday, why wait until 11.59 Friday, Hong Kong Standard Time, like most people? Don't understand. Just do it now. Do it now. Do it now. Do it now. Welcome to week 39, guys. And today, again, I had the privilege of talking to the coin service, the alliance, all the ISB. And before that, I had an unbelievable uh, call with my mentor, Dato Sri Vijay, who I love during this pandemic because I get to spend so much time with him. All right, guys. I want to convey a very important message to you guys. So wherever you are, anywhere in the world, all right, listen carefully to me, your brother, your chief, your upline, okay, representing the great ones, Japa and Datu Sri Vijay. Um, and this is one message which I, I feel it's important that you hear. And it's coming from my heart to you guys. Whether you're brand new, whether you've been in the business for a long time, just listen. Just chill out, put on the headphones, or let your family sit down, including your mother-in-law kids, and, and, and listen to me. Now, whoever you are, wherever you are, you made a decision to start a journey with us. All right? Many of you, or the majority of you watching this Wednesday message, QNet is your first network marketing experience. All right? You may have heard about the industry. You may have known people who tried different network marketing uh, businesses. Some succeeded a little bit, some failed. But for some reason, when you were presented, you said yes, all right? And you participated, okay? You bought a one UV product, a three UV product, a five UV product, a seven UV product. It doesn't matter. All QNET products are simply unbelievable in my opinion, okay? In everyone's opinion. We have some of the greatest products in network marketing from home care, to health care, to energy, to vacation, to luxury. We have it all, guys. And then you started your journey, okay? And you presented to your hot zone, then your warm zone, your cold zone. You got some yes and some no, all right? And uh, you plugged into a system. And then you started to realize that this journey is very interesting. And no matter what people tell you, 
no matter how much you were prepared by your upline in the presentation or during the system, this journey is very special. It is different for everyone and yet the same for everyone. That means what I did in 1998 and what you're doing in 2021, we are on roughly the same journey. We want financial freedom. We want a better life. We want to fulfill that dream that we found that we're willing to fight for and die for. We want to provide better for our families. And, and some of you want to buy Ferraris and villas and, and, and you know, uh, expensive watches and live the life of financial freedom. It's okay, whatever it is. Some of you may want to make money and give it away to the less fortunate and build a hospital and practice the philosophy of rhythm of Dato Sri Vijay and Japa, our great founders. And that's okay. But what I realize is that the trend today in network marketing compared to my time in 1998, sure, I'm talking like an old dude now, okay? Our times were different, okay? I was given the presentation by Dato Sri Vijay Ishwan himself and a lot of people asked me, how did Dato present? Now, Dato presented like all of us. He showed me the plan, a little bit of the plan. He told me, but what I loved about his presentation that he prepared me for the change. He didn't sugarcoat the journey. You know sugarcoat? You take something that's real and you sugarcoat it and people say, wow, so sweet. And suddenly there's a bit of sour, a bit of bitter, then sweet again and they get confused. Dato Sri Vijay didn't sugarcoat. Neither did he make it negative. He just told me the truth. But most important thing about what Dato Sri Vijay did, he prepared me for the journey. And the fact that he prepared me I was less surprised when things happen, right? Even whether it was a rejection, whether it was a challenge with my downlines, whether it's not getting the desired results, whether it's the amount of work and commitment required uh, in network marketing, or even more, it's about the potential challenges and crises that happen in certain countries because of non-regulation, corruption, government doesn't like the industry, whatever. And today... If you're watching this video, whether you are brand new, whether you've been on the journey, let's face the fact. Network marketing is an amazing business, but I hope nobody told you it's going to be easy. I hope that the presenter who presented network marketing to you didn't paint you a picture that was so unreal that you're going to be surprised on day two of your journey. And what happens is, generally in network marketing, the more the picture is unreal, okay, you paint Disneyland and here it's, you know, something else, depending on which country or how the person is building, people quit because their expectation, all right, was not met when they started their journey. The expectation was here, the journey was here. It should be like this, but it's like that. You understand? And then people suddenly feel, oh, I was cheated to, the person didn't explain to me properly, and they quit. And when they quit, they become a liability because they de-edify QNET. They talk negatively about this company and they say, oh, they were, they were they're just prospects. Somebody presented to them. So I'm telling you guys, when you present, paint the most beautiful picture possible, but always based on the truth. All right, the truth must prevail. You must tell people that there's going to be rejections as they start their journey. You must tell people that if you Google QNET, you're going to have a mix of negative and positive news, which is so common even for Fortune 500 companies like Apple or, or, or Microsoft or Tesla. All right, this is the world we live in today. The internet, there's good news, bad news, all jumbled together. And if you have enough common sense, you will be able to decipher the truth. And I believe that you need to paint a beautiful picture based on the truth. If it's a picture of a mountain, paint a mountain. Don't paint the beach. If it's a picture of a beach, paint the picture of the beach, not the desert. All right, because when people start their journey, if the journey is closer to what they expect, they stay. If the journey is too far from what they expected, they run. 
And I have seen this in 23 years. Even committed leaders, dedicated uplines, downlines, whatever, warriors run because they were never prepared for the realities of their journey. I had a downline who was surprised when he or she got a rejection. Why did the guy say no? And I said, didn't somebody tell you that rejection was possible? That I know people who have gotten their first 20 presentations all rejected. I know people 100 presentations rejected and they still stayed and they continued and they finally got a sign up, all right? So I believe that if the journey that the person is starting is closer to what expectation they had in their mind, they stay, they don't run, they don't quit, all right? And ultimately our goal is to keep as many of our downlines on this journey. So imagine if you are taking a train to financial freedom and you're loading the train up with people and this train is going through the mountains and underwater and through tunnels and all that. And every time the train goes through a bit of a dangerous terrain, people run and hide and fall off the train. Your job is to keep more people on the train. And the best way to keep more people on the train is not to surprise them at the journey, but instead prepare them for the journey. Right? People are not morons. They know the potential challenges of entrepreneurship. They know what's going to happen out there. You just got to give them enough confidence all right, that you will be there with them every step of the way. And that's the most important thing I realized being a downline of Dato Sri Vijay. Even though Dato Sri Vijay told me enough of the truth, when I was on the journey to financial freedom, I faced challenges. Like you, I had moments of frustration. I had moments where I couldn't answer my downline because the company didn't give me answers. All right, because the company was still, you know, managing the situation to get answers. But whenever I went back to Dato Sri Vijay, regardless of what he said, what was more important, that he was there. He was there to speak, to listen, to guide, to redirect me and prepare me for the next potential surprise that I'm going to face in network marketing. Because if you are going to take this journey to financial freedom, there's going to be surprises. There's going to be challenges. There's going to be good times and bad times and great times. And finally, when you reach a certain level of success, your conviction reaches a level where nothing surprises you anymore, like where I am, where all the V partners, AVP, VCs, ISB, V elite leaders, all right? These guys are like, hey, I know this works. I know this company is real. I trust this company completely. And whatever people say, whatever challenges I face out there, it's okay. You understand? I will stay on this train no matter what, no matter how dark the tunnel gets. No matter how challenging, right, the temperature, the weather, all right, no matter if rocks are falling down from the mountain and potentially hitting on this train, I stay on the train. Now, your job is to get people to stay on the train. Because one thing I can guarantee you, no matter how long the journey is, no matter how complicated the journey is, you will still reach financial freedom. And if if people are going to react in absolute surprise, that, oh my God, there's a negative article about QNet. Oh my God, you lied. It's all a scam. I want to run away. That means who prepared this person for this journey? That's my question. Are you kidding me? Are you expecting to be in a business that will never have anything negative said about it? It does not exist, guys. Right? Ice cream companies, McDonald's, airlines, every single company in the world has had some form of criticism, negative media, enemies, competitors that attack it. Now, why would somebody think differently on their journey in network marketing? With us, a 23-year-old legitimate company. Why? Because whoever brought them in, whoever is managing them, whoever is taking them through this journey, didn't prepare them properly. Didn't manage their expectation. See, ultimately, network marketing is about bringing somebody on this journey, holding their hand, carrying them all the way, but also managing their expectation because you don't want them to be surprised. But surprise people freak out and run.
And you need to always remember this, that you don't have the answers for everything. The company may not have the answers for everything all the time. But as long as you are there for them, giving them that confidence, not avoiding them, talking, engaging them every single day, like Dato Sri Vijay and Japa has done for 23 years with all the leaders around the world during every challenge or crisis. That's all you need to do. You see, you can only do your best. Don't allow, all right, anything or anyone to take you to a point of frustration that you become ineffective to the rest of your network. Don't allow one situation or one group of networkers to reduce your effectiveness to the other group which is relying on you. Right? See, I'm applying to all of you around the world, representing Japa and Datu Sri Vijay, and I handle stuff every single day. But it cannot change who I am for that day. I'm still applying. Right? I still got to speak from my heart and give you enough love, confidence, knowledge, inspiration for you to go another day on this amazing journey with us and stay on the train and, and have faith that one day we will reach our final destination called financial freedom. So whoever you are out there, if you are right now surprised by something that's happening on your journey, relax. Right? We've been around for 23 years. Sometimes there's some things that happen, right? Some negative things, some negative comments, some people commenting. Don't freak out. Don't panic, right? You're not alone. There's a whole organization. There's a whole mechanism with you. We will resolve things. It may take three days or three months, but if you stay on this train, I promise you, you will reach the ultimate destination of financial freedom. I've seen this with my own eyes for 23 years. I am living proof. All I did was stay on the train and have faith in Dato Sri Vijay and Japa that they will not allow this train to stop. That no matter what happens, no matter how big the rocks from the mountains, no matter how cold or hot the weather, all right, no matter what is around us, I can only promise you one thing. That whatever you're going through right now, Whoever you are, wherever you are, we have all been through it before. And if your dream is still important to you, just trust us enough and stay on this train with us. This train is built on integrity, love, warriorship, rhythm, dreams. And this train is driven by two great men, Japanese Bismarck and Dato Sri Vijay. They will never let you down. I promise you, just stay on the train. Don't jump off. Don't freak out. No matter how bad you think the situation is in your journey, it will pass. It can only get better, guys. Just remember, you're not alone. We are with you. The V is your umbrella. It's your family. It's a little bit of rain. Don't freak out. Just come under the umbrella. The sun will come out again and the train of financial freedom will never stop. I promise you this. So I'm speaking to all of you who are now experiencing a surprise in your journey. Just stay strong. Have faith. Remember your dream. And most importantly, remember you're not alone. So stay on the train. Just stay on the train and I promise you, you will reach the destination. Love you guys.